This week on Siskel and Ebert, Bruce Willis plays a psychotic killer with a muttering problem in Mumbler. And in this scene, he interrogates a cocky waiter played by John yeah, Travolta. I don't care what you believe, all right? Look, all I know is he complained about some salad dressing when he came into the restaurant. The guy walks in there like he's Clint Eastwood or somebody. I said, make my day. Leave me a tip. I'm working here. Wake up, buddy. I need your help on my new experiment. Meet me at the University Mall at exactly 1.30 a.m. And Marty, whatever you do, don't eat anything. Holy time travel, Doc. You didn't have to go all the way back to the 50s to get food. No, 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 Marty. We didn't go back in time at all. We're at the corner diner at 600 South Illinois Avenue in Carbondale. They're open 24 hours a day so you can get a perfect meal anytime you want. Take a bite out of your past and look to the future at the corner diner in Carbondale. Like gummy monsters. I can't live without my gummy monsters. <laughs> Forgive the interruption, but... Frankly, that statement is untrue. That a member of the Monster Guard may not, under any circumstances, conceal his or her identity. You know who I am. I'm Cole Zamone, commander of the Rim, supreme deck leader. I don't understand. I was at my compound, and there were explosions. I was with Elia. Where's Elia? Bring me my daughter! Buy the new and improved Monster Demangler Hair Untangler for the low, low price of $29.99. Order now, and we'll throw in the whirling, unfurling, curling iron and the hay. Stop in a rush brush. Give us your money now. The Monster Weather Station wants to remind you that tornadoes can happen in our part of the country, and you need to stay prepared. The following is a dramatization. All of the celebrity voices have been impersonated. Because you've got to admit, you're listening to A Day in the Life, The Beatles Radio Biography. Hey, Brian. What's wrong, Eppy? I want to hold your hand. The new single by The Beatles has reached number one in America. Boys, this is it! A Day in the Life. I think it's fantastic. For the complete adventures of the Fab Four in A Day in the Life, The Beatles. Biography. It's history, and it's happening now. We like The Beatles. They're fab. 